Hey everyone, welcome to Apigee Edge 4 minute videos for developers season 26. In this series, we're going to discuss about Apigee Edge private cloud as well as see some hands on videos on installing Apigee Edge on private cloud, which is nothing but on premises. Myself, Anil Sagar, I work at Google and Apigee platform. Apigee follows cloud native deployment strategy. That means whatever the software and the features and the architecture powering Apigee Edge cloud, same is available for on premises too. Let's take a look at different deployment strategies or models available for Apigee. As you know, Apigee is available software as a service on cloud. We have seen only earlier videos where we can build APIs without worrying about SLAs or maintaining the infrastructure, scaling the infrastructure up and down because Apigee manages all the hosting users focus on building API programs. Apigee SaaS is today available both on Google Cloud as well as AWS. If you choose Google Cloud, there are certain advantages that you can leverage from the Google, which Apigee is part of. Apigee Edge is also available on on-premise. That means we give you the software which you can install and deploy on your own private cloud data centers or on-premise machines. You can able to install Apigee Edge platform on your own data center, even inside the demilitarized zones or air gap servers. You can also run Apigee Edge without even connecting to the internet. Apigee also supports hybrid where the micro gateways can be on on-premise and you can at the same time leverage Apigee Edge Cloud for analytics developer portal and API management. Apigee also supports multi-cloud. Let's discuss in detail about these different deployment strategies. Apigee Edge Cloud. Let's say you have different enterprise systems and where your legacy applications are new kind of greenfield implementations like microservices or you have integration point to point using ESBs within your enterprise. Generally, you will expose within the enterprise services through load balancer like FI or Nginx to the outside world. Apigee can sit inside the cloud and it can securely connect to the load balancer using mutual SSL. Once you connect to the backend services, you can able to do the API management on Apigee Edge platform and expose the new kind of APIs to the partners, mobile applications, or even internal applications or cloud applications. This is the typical Apigee Edge cloud deployment. Let's take a look at Apigee Edge on-premises. You will typically have the similar microservices, internal applications, and ESB server, which is talking to legacy applications. You will install Apigee Edge within your firewalls which sits inside the demilitarized zones or private cloud data centers and talks to different backend systems, again, secured using mutual SSL. The endpoint of Apigee will be exposed to the outside world using load balancer or security gateway like FI or Nginx. To your partners, developers, internal applications or mobile applications or web applications or cloud applications. In earlier season, we discussed about Edge Micro Gateway, so I'm gonna skip that one. Let's discuss about multi-cloud. Today, most of the enterprises have the backend services running in different clouds. It can be Google Cloud, Azure, or Pivotal Cloud Foundry, or even platforms like OpenShift, Mesosphere, or AWS. Obviously, when different workloads are running on different clouds, you want the API gateways are also in these clouds so that the latencies are less. Obviously, you want to have all the muzzles that does the heavy lifting on each and every one of this cloud. At the same time, you want to have a single API management platform where you can manage the APIs. Say, I want to deploy this API to Google Cloud Platform. I want to deploy this API to Pivotal Cloud Foundry because the backend workloads are on the respective cloud platforms or private cloud data centers. And you want to have and seamless visibility across these clouds where your backends are running. You would like to apply the consistent security and onboard the developers who will be consuming the APIs that will be running on different clouds. So Apigee will work like a brain and all the gateways can sit on multiple clouds which will be acting like a muzzles. We're going to see more in detail about Apigee on-premises in this series, stay tuned. If you are interested to evaluate Apigee Edge, you can reach out to us using this link. If you have any questions, please feel free to post your questions in commit.apigee.com. Please share this video with your friends and colleagues and help us spread the love for APIs. You can also subscribe to YouTube channel and stay updated if any future videos.